stun grenades. Stun grenades that had nails and stones attached to them and threw them amongst children. Is this the sort of Prime Minister that you want no. to run Ukraine? No, we do not. Who would want a Prime Minister like that? We would like a Prime Minister that is like a Prime Minister that is here in Great Britain. Where Great Britain is a wonderful country. And it's right on the David. to be part of the European Union. During our protest, you will hear us shout, Ban do het! This means this mob out, which relates to the mafia of the government that is running Ukraine currently. You will also hear us shout, Slava Ukraini! This means glory to its heroes. Citizens of Birmingham, let me tell you more. What really is going on in Ukraine? Let me tell you the horrible truth that is hidden from the Western world. And what has happened in Ukraine since the 24th of November. You will be shocked in the manner in which the current Ukrainian government under President Yanukovych treats its citizens. Journalists from Europe are being shot like dogs on the street. Cameras and other equipment is being destroyed so as to not let the news spread into the Western world. This equipment is being destroyed on site. Slava Ukraine! extremists by the government. The Ministry of Internal Affairs refuses to start investigations about people, innocent people, being protests. On the basis of official claims need to be made to the police. But the people cannot make official claims to the police as guess what? The police will arrest them and they will then throw him into jail and then they will beat them, torture them and maybe even murder them. Volunteers, Red Cross, who are in Ukraine are being shot at daily while helping injured, injured Ukrainians, Ukrainians dying on the floor. They are helping them in extreme freezing temperatures of minus 20 degrees and are being shot at themselves. Morgues in Kiev have been reporting hundreds of unidentified, unidentified bodies being brought in by the Ukrainian militia and being dropped off with no explanation. You all know the 2004 Eurovision winner, Ruslana. She has, been, she has received several death threats for her support for Ukraine to be part of Europe. I think now we will show you how Ukrainians, Ukrainians really behave. And, a, and what a happy nation and a peaceful nation we are. We will start, we will sing a song. Okay. Please ask me by my peace now. I will lose you too. 